uh, in this lecture we are going to create this sheet metal part so let's start with the annex sheet metal so first i am going to create this base sketch at xy plane so we start from the rectangle and again one more rectangle here okay and now dimension it this dimension is this one 88.9 is from outside to inside okay so 88 89.6 from out to out mm, I don't know uh, we have to create this because the sheet will come outside okay so 88.6 this value is outside so 87.6 87.6 and this is 59 and zoom it and this value is not given here so I'm going to mirror it okay so click here mirror select this center line is this apply and again same I'm doing with here okay now dimension 89 from out to out out And this value is I don't know from center to center to center this from here to this is 73.5 and close okay now here we have two circles so click one and one more two and draw simple line from this quadrant to inside okay here as well now dimension it make a circle as vertically align and align with this as well okay and click over this line and make this vertical and now to use the string now dimension uh, 2 and here it is 7 so 7 is the diameter and this one is 4 diameter and this is 6 it is not given here but I am taking this as 7 and the distance is 5 to 6 it is also not given so I am selecting this 5 and okay now my sketch is complete just mirror this apply and I'm going to pattern it on the other side so here we have the pattern and my curves are this and direction is this 2 and the distance is 73 from 72 center okay so this is the sketch finish and now go to preferences and here I'm going to change the value as thickness 1 and one okay use this tab and reason I want to create this 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 and okay and hide this okay now use this to the blend no no it is creating all over but I want only here 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 okay now select the flange I want to flange here and at center and this width is 57 and it is outside that is okay and the height is 27 from this inside 
it is 27 okay and apply same here I am doing it is outside and okay if we apply this square so this will cut like this okay we did not as per our drawing okay just click it apply and the thickness is 27 this is 28 1 already which is here so it is 30 uh, 1 is here and 27 is 28 apply and click here reverse the direction now it is adding okay so keep it outside so no 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 here I am selecting this like this okay and from and this is my and point and one from here and this is thickness is 39.9 apply and again over this this time my side is this reverse the side and wait 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 the thickness is 57 minus 47.9 okay and this length is only 9.5 length is 9.5 okay from outside it is inside or web okay this is web okay and double click over it it is 9.5 and from the web and okay so this this is this all complete we have to define some chamfer so here chamfer one chamfer is here and one chamfer is here okay and we have to specify to hold we have hold and its position is not properly specified so some value I am going to take my own so 8.5 from the left and from top I am just taking 5 and the dimensions are 5 dia okay click and mirror it and next I'm going to draw a rectangle and now dimension it 29 vertically aligned again this gap in this distance is missing so I am taking the distance as 4 only ok now finish and cut with normal cutout it will also work and hide this So this is my sheet metal part. Hope you understand this properly.